spend any time together anymore. It's always work, work, work. Like, well, what do you expect? What there's do I great, expect? Yeah, there's a great scripture that says, a uh, nagging wife is like a dripping faucet. We are not talking about, home. we're not Why talking about scripture right here. We're talking I'm about talking you about being a father. We're work, talking about you being a husband to me. I come home, all I get is, you didn't do this, you didn't do this. They you always have to do this. Don't even feel like reading anymore. Why don't you let you me talk? Of, go ahead. You want to talk? Go ahead. I do want to talk. You are but never. That's all you do. But you never open up. You keep everything inside. Everything because inside. If I do. Oh, hey, Darla. You're here early. Yeah, I thought I'd get started early today. I hope, I hope that's not an issue. Not at all. Joseph, what? stop. They're right all now. sleeping. Come on. Okay, fine. <laughs> what are you doing later? Uh, I should be done after five. Okay. Well, I, uh, I'll probably make it over after work, okay? Okay. Oh, uh, hey, honey. Um, how are, I mean, do you want something to eat? N no, I'm good. I'll, I'll make you breakfast. I'm all right. Just let her make you something to eat. I said that I'm not hungry. It's okay. I'll make you something simple and I'm gonna put it over there and when you're ready to eat, it'll, okay. Your mom's gonna be home from yoga soon so she'll drive you to school, okay? Oh, and, and if you could do me a favor, please let her know that I've got a dinner meeting tonight so I'm probably gonna be home late. But my dance recital is tonight. All right, look, what if I talk to my boss and I ask him to let me off the hook, okay? I don't wanna miss my baby show. All right, honey, see ya, Darla. Eliana, hey, have a good day. Okay. Wait, are you okay? You seem really tired. Yeah, I'm fine. I just didn't get a lot of sleep last night. Yeah, I, I know, you and me both. Um, wait, Eliana, I have to tell you something. Your dad and I, um, I know you've heard us, and I just, I, I can't lie to you anymore. We're, Eliana, your dad and I are, we're, we're getting a divorce. I, I, wait, Eliana, stop. Ellie, wait. Ellie. It just sucks because I remember when Taylor's parents got divorced and I felt so bad for her. I mean, I literally remember her crying on my shoulder. And I told her all this positivity stuff that now I really don't even know if I believe. <sighs> and now I'm the one that needs someone to say all of that to me. Well, I went through it too. I'm just not sure if it's better to go through it younger like I was or now. But either way, it sucks. But if one positive thing came from it was my parents are actually better now. What do you mean by that? Well, they're kind of like becoming friends, I guess, which is cool. Oh, hey guys. Uh... I didn't know you were here, Jensen. Hey, Mr. Wilson. So, Jensen, do you mind if I uh, 
talk to Ellie for a second. Yeah, of course. Um, I should probably get going home anyways, Ellie. You can call me later. Okay, bye. Bye. So unfortunately, I heard your mother couldn't help but share about our situation, which doesn't surprise me. I mean, given the fact that she can never keep anything to herself when we discuss that we want. All right, can we just not do this right now, please? All right, look, Ellie. I'm sorry, honey. It's true, we are getting a divorce. But we just feel like it's the best decision for both of us at the moment. How long have you been talking about this for? Honestly, I... We've been unhappy for some time now, for years. But I, I wanted to hold off until you were done with high school. But you know your mother, she's just... She's not the easiest sometimes. How was your meeting? What? Your meeting the other night? <laughs> oh, you mean my work meeting? It was, it was, it was fine. Why? Well, it must have been pretty important because you missed my dance recital for it. So. Well, honey, it, it was work. What do you want me to do? Have you told mom about you and Darla? Hey, Jerry, hold on one second. Honey, please, I'm so sorry. I have to take this. It's a client call that I have to take. Just stay here. I'll be right back, OK? Jerry, what's up? Do you have everything? Yeah. Just, just try to have a good time, okay? I'll try. Look, it's only for a weekend. If at any point you feel uncomfortable at all, just give me a call and I'll come get you. All right? Sounds like a plan. Okay. Bye, Mom. Hey, sweetie. Thanks, Sarah. Welcome. How you doing? I'm fine. Just fine? Yeah, I'm okay. Oh, come on. We're excited to have you. Good to see you, sweetie. Yeah. You can never underestimate how traumatic divorce is for the kids of the parents. If your friend or anyone you're close to has parents going through a divorce, just try to be there for them and support them with friendship as much as you can. Divorce is a journey that the kids involved don't ask to take. They're forced along for a ride where the results are dictated by the road their parents decide to travel. For all the kids that have divorced parents, just remember that you are not the problem and your parents are most likely doing their best to maneuver their problems, but still be there for you. Have you told mom about you and Darla? Uh, <laughs> Hold on. I'm sorry, that's Hold so on, funny please. for no <laughs> Yeah, you just say that's so sad. <laughs> it's so sad. But you know, it's just. Well, so you're not gonna use that one. Ah! Dude. It's like five seconds before you start talking, but you throw your gun away. Nasty. Yeah. <laughs> that's not good no, to have a gun. You're gonna throw it on yourself. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know if I heard cut or anything. Like, oh shit. I think I looked dead into the camera. Yeah, <laughs> did I look into the camera again? Yes, you did. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Look. Oh, shoot. Uh, who's, yes, can, can, we can we take the 
the chimes down. Where, oh, is that someone? That's it's a doorbell. doorbell. Oh, the doorbell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, sweetie. Thanks, Sarah. Hi, baby. You look beautiful. Seriously, we got a film here. What the hell are you doing? Get your FedEx out of here. Get out of here. What if he hurts you? It's all right. I, I guess I won't get any more FedEx. Uh. <laughs> Reset one more time. We gotta get you.